start kick. And then I'll, while that's going, I'll get my chat stuff all properly situated on this side. Perfect. You are live on Twitch. Perfect. Uh, stream manager. Which I should put Discord down. Ah! Discord will go down here. Twitch. Yeah, Twitch is live now. Good. I mean, I guess I don't actually have the Twitch open. You'll tell, you told me the Twitch is open, so I need to have Kick and Creator Dashboard YouTube open. So yeah, Kick is live. Apparently, I've been live for 28 minutes. That doesn't make any sense. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> that doesn't sound good. I don't know about that one, guys. Uh, how do I pop out my chat? There it is. Pop out chat. And I can close Kick because at least my chat is open. And YouTube, go live, and it should hopefully say live, unless it's being weird again. Uh, YouTube. Uh, that's taking a long time to load. Connecting stream software. Oh, yeah, okay, here we go. Um, YouTube is not live, but that's probably because I have to whatever reason it always goes private whenever it's private it does not actually go live if i go public sometimes it goes live all right and then i hit save let's see if it goes live no <laughs> Let me double check to make sure I actually hit YouTube. Okay, I'll hit stop on YouTube and then start again. <laughs> How is YouTube... Okay, there we go. <laughs> How is YouTube the one that's giving me problems? There we go. Now YouTube's open. YouTube's chat's open. Kick's chat's open. And Twitch chat's open. I, if anyone's talking to me in Twitch, I will be there in a second because that's currently closed while I get... Well, that's because Stream Elements is connected to Twitch. Okay. Uh, yeah, I can confirm you are live on YouTube. Okay. We are good. All right. Um... Oh, I'm getting an ad because I my sub uh, subs uh, <laughs> expired. Let's fix that. There we go. Oh, I have to put Joy to Key on. God, shoot. <laughs> or else we're not gonna be able to use our controllers. <laughs> Which you need to when you're playing a Saturn game. Especially one as funky as this. Hey, it actually shows that you actually subscribed with Prime. That, it, I think that's the first time it's actually shown that. It's new. Yeah, normally, normally it didn't. It just, it only did that whenever it was, um, like a regular subscriber, but for the first time it's saying, hey, you did it with Prime. All right, yes. Oh, would you fairy play tricks on me again? Are we actually going to do more than one battle this week? <laughs> oh. <sighs> oh. All right, we were doing the, uh... I'm getting my Master Monk, except she's not a Master Monk. She's just a regular monk. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Will she ever attain the rank of master? Oh uh, yeah, that's what she... So, that's the thing about Shiny Force 3. We won't get to this, but in Shiny Force Scenario 3, there is a promotion beyond promotion. Oh, okay. Yeah, so I can't remember what that one's called, but yeah, the first promotion is a Master Monk. Okay. But there... It, as much as I'm like saying, oh, she's amazing, she's not as good as Sarah, Karna, or... She's probably as good, or maybe a little bit better than Sheila, but it no, it nothing compares to the <laughs> Sarah and Karna. So you don't have to worry about her that much. Good. That was uh, that was horrifying. <laughs> well, Karna's was just broken in general. All right. Um, I legit don't know where. Look at all these priests. <laughs> um, I actually don't know where I'm going. Oh, so before the stream, we were talking about food prices. Yes. Um, so on Fridays, um, we I usually will... Um, generally, my workday starts a little bit later. Mm -hmm. 
So I'll go and I'll get us like McDonald's or Tim Hortons or some kind of like treat for breakfast. I love. I went to... Have you had? Uh, this doesn't sound weird. Have you had Tim Hortons as a steak and cheese egg breakfast sandwich? I have not. I so. It sounds and looks disgusting, and it probably is. But for whatever reason, I greatly enjoy it. It's really good, eh? Okay. I don't know if it is, and if it is or not. I enjoy it though. I don't I, know why. I can't do Tim Hortons new eggs. I can't. They're new eggs. So Tim Hortons used to have um, frozen, folded, processed yeah. eggs. Yeah, processed eggs. They're using actual right? eggs now, aren't they? They are. But the way that they cook them is... Oh, it's greasy. It doesn't taste well, it's... right. <laughs> no, it's rubbery. I thought they were I, greasy, I just, yeah. I can't do it. That's fair. Um, what the fuck is anyway. a lucky cookie? Permanently... We have luck? Is luck a stat? Oh my god, it is. it is. That must be based off for crits. <gasps> Wait, if that's the case, what is Don Terra's? The one who always gets... a oh, five. So that's not it then. Six. Six. Five. Okay, so that's definitely not it. So, <laughs> anyway, I went to, to Morton's. I got a steep tea. Okay, large. Oh, I am I feel like I, you're the only other person who gets a steep tea at Tim Hortons. They're so good. They are good. <laughs> I got a medium ice cap. I got a bagel belt. So bagel, egg, lettuce, tomato. Mm -hmm. Um, a hash brown because it came with the combo, so mm -hmm. it was ended up being like thirty cents. Do you like their hash browns? They're fine. They're yeah. I see. I was thinking the same thing. I'd rather. I'd rather McDonald's. Well, McDonald's are deep fried. Yeah. Like you can't compare the two. No. Um, and a bagel with cream cheese for myself. Mm hmm. After taxes, I want you to guess the amount. Okay, so bagel with cream cheese, steep tea. Yep. Ice cap. Ice cap. Oh, that's the most expensive item there. Bagel belt bagel and a belt hash brown. And a hash brown. Well, the bagel belt. So I'm assuming the steep tea, the hash brown, and the bagel belt, they would have at least made a combo for you. Correct. Okay. So then the other thing would have been the, what was it, the... Cream, bagel, cream, bagel cheese. Cream, cream cheese, and, and an ice cap. Yes. What size of ice cap? Medium. Okay. What size tea, steep tea? Large. Fourteen uh, ten. Higher. Seventeen. Higher. No way. Really? After taxes, it was eighteen dollars. Okay, how much is the ice cap, medium ice cap, then? I believe I, that was three dollars and eighty-nine cents. Oh, see, I thought it was. I, I put that at three fifty. Um, I think the bagel belt was five seventy. The bagel with cream cheese was like three forty. Like, there's not varying prices across the areas, right? Because I feel like it's cheaper in Kingston. <laughs> It can vary depending on competition, but at least where I was, that that came to eighteen dollars taxes in. I couldn't friggin' believe it. Cause what do I do? What so whenever I go into the office, which is like twice a week, but like I, it's so early, like I have to wake up. I have to leave here by four forty-five, right? Um, oh God. So I don't have time to make. I don't have time to make breakfast. <laughs> um. So I go to Tim Hortons to get to get something to you know, keep me awake. <laughs> um, to keep you alive. Alive. So normally what I get is is a medium steep tea. Okay. Uh, and then an old-fashioned plain donut, because I'm one of those people. Sure. And um, uh, my, my bagel and cream cheese, and that's like only like $7. <laughs> right, but a medium steep tea is two. Yeah, I know. It's just... The but, donut's one. I mean... I. Okay, so I know uh, this week I actually did splurge a bit more because it's like I haven't been in the office in like two weeks. So I was like, I guess I can spend a little bit more. Um, it was a large steep tea. Uh, my old uh, walnut crunch because they're back for limited time. Nice. <laughs> uh, and then I got my uh, steak, egg, and 
cheese dripping grease delicious biscuit and that was i think i think that was like ten dollars okay so, so now my, I had four, yeah. but I had four dollars for an ice cap. Yeah, that, that, that's it. Is that it's the ice cap that I keep forgetting how expensive ice caps are. Where it's am I crazy. going? <laughs> um, it's it's nuts. And then the last treat we had before, um, was I think I forget what we when this was. I think a week, couple weeks ago. Um, I had to get something at the store after I was done work, so I decided you know instead of making dinner. I had to go to a Walmart. The Walmart has a McDonald's. Mm -hmm. We'll just grab McDonald's for dinner. I had a coupon for a Big Mac combo. Mm -hmm. Big Mac, medium fry, medium drink. Yep. And then I added, uh, they have a new sandwich. It's um, it's a hot honey McC uh, McCrispy. Yep. Just the sandwich. Yep. So two sandwiches. One fry, one drink. Twenty goddamn dollars with a coupon that knocked the dollar eighty off. Mm -hmm. Like what? What even is the point of fast food anymore? Yeah, it, it's only it's only for fast. Yeah, because it sure as hell ain't cheap. No, it's not cheap anymore. That's what that was the the quote unquote appeal of it at one right. point. And and now like they they've cheaped out so hard. Even their like McPix menu, mm -hmm. which is the McDouble and the McChicken or the Junior, Junior Chicken. Chicken. Yeah, yeah. Um, with it, it, the combo is now a small fry and a small drink. drink yeah, and it's six dollars. Yeah. Like man, I. <laughs> That's why when I was in university. Yeah, you lived off that, didn't you? Like shit, man. I, I could get uh, the the combo, the medium combo. I think was three fifty mm -hmm. for medium fries, medium drink, and a junior chicken. It's funny that you mentioned this because where I went to school, we had a cafeteria, and they had, and we, the deal was so well known. They started calling it the Happy Meal. But it was basically a proper, like, it was like a McChicken, but it was an actual, like, it wasn't just a circle patty. It was like, it actually looked like a chicken. It was a proper, like a chicken breast. Yeah. But it was like, it was crispy. It had lettuce, you know. It, it was basically a McChicken. So, like, the lettuce, the mayonnaise, and all that. And, a f and a, the fry was, like, proper potato cut fries. And they were thick cut. And they gave you a bunch. And a drink. Eight dollars. At a university where they gouge you, at or a college. college where they gouge you. Yeah, but it was considered the happy meal because, dude, you would not. The fries was like if you, I don't even know how to describe it. It was, it was the burger was swimming in the amount of fries they gave you. So like, um, it was a good five, deal. Like, like like five like five guys style. Yeah, and and the burger wasn't like a small size McChicken. It was like if you um. You know those big, thick buns you get at the grocery store? Yes. That size. Ooh, like a Kaiser roll. Yeah. Okay. So, $8 for that patty, that burger, the fries, and a drink. That's why it was called the Happy Meal that everyone ordered. Because right. what you got for that $8 was I, a lot. Yeah. I remember at university, there were... There was the main food court at the university center. Mm -hmm. In there, they had a pasta station. Mm -hmm. And so you could pick your pasta, you pick your sauce, you pick your um, your, your toppings. And they'd make you like a, a pasta. Yeah. And I'd always get um, like um, half, like a rosé sauce. So yeah. half tomato, half Alfredo. Penne pasta loaded with veggies and chicken. Parmesan cheese, and it came with a little like mini baguette, and it was eight dollars, and oh. it, it was like a, a a hunk of food. Yeah. Um, like whenever I was gonna order it, I would intentionally skip breakfast because otherwise I wouldn't finish it. Yeah. Then on the other side of campus, in the low building, in the basement, <laughs> there was a smaller food court, and it had a stir fry station where you could make your own stir fries. Yeah. With like your a teriyaki sauce or um, 
they tried to do like um uh, I guess it'd be almost like um like a Japanese yakisoba kind of sauce. Obviously, it's like a, a poor imitation, but they they were trying to like offer different flavors. Yeah. Um, Korean barbecue. Um, and it was also eight dollars. Is this our battle? Okay, this is the battle. And like I <laughs> spent way too much damn money in retrospect on those places. But my God, were they good? Okay. And like, unlike you, like you were on campus. Uh, I was not. I easily could have just like packed a lunch or yeah, or cheaped it out. And I, in hindsight, probably should have more often. Mm -hmm. But uh, my God, it was good. It's so good that a few times we've been, when um, when we've gone to Ottawa, there's my master. I've tried mark. to nice. <laughs> I've I've tried to convince Heather to go to just like pop into the university for lunch. Oh my goodness. Just like, pretend like you belong, and like, just order You're like You're an lunch. alumni, right? We are. Yeah, so you can go like, in there. Technically, as alumni, we're allowed in. Yeah. But like, just, you know, act like you belong, and order your pasta. <laughs> Good lord. <laughs> okay, so just, uh, this is gonna be a quick, uh, tell you what's going on. Uh, we were trying to get to train to get back to the Republic, but then the em Empire got on the train because technically we're their territory, so we're trying to sneak onto the train. So we've we're waiting for the train to leave, so we snuck into the the cargo area, uh, and then well, monsters are in there. And this person's tied up. Uh, no, she was hiding in the crate because she's trying to um, <laughs> cross the border. Hilarious. <laughs> Why is she tied up now? She's not tied up. She was just the. She was in a, all cuddled up in a crate. Touch me. Oh, and there I, we go. Touch me and I hurt you. Oh damn! Like I said. Oh, he's <laughs> dead. No, we're not in the train. We're in the cargo, like where, like the the warehouse where they have the cargo to load onto the train. Oh. Hi, go ahead and fight her at that. The boys over there have their hands full, so you guys are over here help out. Uh, Oh god, you have flying units already. <laughs> but who are you guys? Chief, there are more witnesses at the entrance. Okay, so they're they're just bandits, okay. <laughs> the bandits, yeah, there you go. <laughs> Can't abandon that girl Irene. We're not. Trust me. <sighs> just help that poor girl. Oh, she don't need no help. I mean she does. <laughs> she's not she's probably not a very good level. Not to mention, I have to figure out how to get her to talk in order for me to recruit her, and I have to figure out how I get her down. That's a problem. Um. Enter the box? Yeah, so. What? So this is where. This is like. Oh god, you have so many units. Uh multi-level maps there's like multiple maps inside of a map now right so inside those crates that we moved into is just another mini map inside this map that's one element that i greatly enjoy about this game is that all right go irene oh god are you not equipped Two damage are you not equipped are you controlling, by the way? Yeah, you are, right? Yeah. Wow. I'm all good. I just realized that you were controlling, and I never hit the start button on the second player. Oh, no. Magic. Oh. Yep. <laughs> Mitchell, <Bird> don't... Man. <laughs> Mitchell, don't kill her. <laughs> it's my only job. You want me to rotate the map for you? <laughs> there you go. <laughs> like, it implies... Okay, so I guess if I go here, I can go up there next turn. Yeah. Okay, cool. 
Birdman. Harvey Birdman? Yeah. Which we'll be playing Ace Attorney, so after this. <laughs> Sweet. That'll be fun. That will be fun. Oh, he's actually doing damage! Did you see that? <laughs> Hooray! I just realized I can't let anyone- I can't let him die because I have to actually buy new weapons for people. <laughs> I put him in a horrible position. <laughs> Sorry, I used to watch the actual Birdman with my dad. I've only seen the, uh... Wait, like the actual, like, Birdman cartoon? <laughs> yeah. That's incredible. Because I've only seen him in Harvey Birdman I Attorney didn't, I at didn't ever saw that. Uh, I've only seen the Attorney at Law one. <laughs> okay, so she actually has high attack. You just must have... Yeah, okay. Because <laughs> I think her attack's higher than his? Oh, no, he got a new sword. You're still weak. Fucking Jesus, like... And speed. What the hell? How did you see these shows? I, I I saw Space Ghost Coast to Coast, the parody. Mm -hmm. C Lab 2021. Her the dad parody. had like DVDs and VHSs. I'm assuming. Like, uh, okay. All these old shows. Here we're in the mini map uh, now. Which, by the way, C <laughs> underrated. Um, C Lab 2021. Fantastic. It's it's so. Uh, I don't know if you, if you know what C Lab is. It was, I think it was from the 70s, but it was like an environmentally based show mm -hmm. where um, it's basically about this crew who are in a sea lab under the sea, under um, the sea. Okay. <laughs> studying, you know, uh, ocean, ocean life and, um, you know, working to like protect nature and sea life and stuff. Mm hmm. So that's like the the principle of like the actual show. So for for um C Lab 2021 um they basically just turn they turn the crew stupid but they make the captain like a complete like lunatic psychopath. Yep. Um who consistently by the end of many episodes leads to the um the destruction of the Sea Lab and everyone dying. Uh, but like Kenny on South Park, they just come back the next episode as if nothing happened. Ah, uh, okay. Um, well, the whole thing is very, very funny. Um, and then probably one of the most infamous episodes they did. Um, I think the episode is just called Sea Lab 2020. Sorry. There you go. And um, they basically just do a Sea Lab episode. Like, did this take the entire episode, no edits? They just redubbed it with the voice actors, mm -hmm. and everything is completely normal, as if it was just a regular 1970s C Lab episode. I think until the very end when it blows up. <laughs> uh, my papa had US satellite with Cartoon Network and Deja Vu view. Nice. Oh, that's a ton of damage. That's a lot of damage. It's not that much damage. <laughs> now that's a lot of damage, Phil. <laughs> Are you alright, Phil? <laughs> oh, that's it. Everyone get away. Phil's lost it. He's He's been sniffing too much flex glue. Phil, you make me angry, <laughs> Phil. You could just use one of these, Phil. All right. <laughs> uh. Where? Where uh, are these guys? Oh, they're they're uh, to the east of the main uh, map. You actually have to go through the mini the mini map to get to them. I think here. 
you good? You you gonna you just gonna keep circling around? <laughs> the hell? You can can I get to you? Oh, yeah, I can go to you from here. Well, yeah, you can, but like, <laughs> why would you do that? Why would you do that, Phil? <laughs> Um, what were we going to talk about? We had a couple topics, and I've forgotten. The Royal least... Rumble? Oh yeah, the Royal Rumble, and uh, Jim Carrey being brought back as Dr. Robotnik for Sonic 3, even though he said Sonic that 2. That is not shocked at all. I'm a little shocked, because he, he seemed very adamant that the number 2 was going to be the last one. As soon as they announced number 3, I knew. He's he's honestly, he's such a, um, a perfectionist to his work. Mm-hmm. I, I knew there's no way he would leave that. It's, He'd finish it. Yeah, I mean, I'm glad because I don't think they could find anyone to replace him as a Dr. Robotnik. No. The only way they'd be able... To, the only thing they'd be able to do is effectively um, just not have Robotnik. Yeah. Just make Shadow the antagonist and call it a day. That's what I thought they were going to do. Um, but, um, but yeah, that's, that's fantastic. Um, Royal Rumble was actually really disappointing. Yeah, that's what I've heard so far. Um, very much, um, nothing, no real surprises. Um, uh, biggest surprise was, um, the uh, TNA Women's Champion mm -hmm. appeared uh, as a Royal Rumble entrant. Okay. Um, which was nice to see, but that was kind of it in terms of like any surprises at all. Yeah. Um, Roman Reigns retains because, of course. I mean, WrestleManias were we're hopefully he's gonna lose it, right? Correct. Um. But, um... You think the Skaven knows magic? <laughs> that's what the try. <laughs> of course. Skaven's dead. <laughs> He's dead, Jim. He's dead, Jim. I was saving him for Obrid, too, damn it! <laughs> um... There were only four matches. Um... Well, WrestleMania is like a three-fucking-day event now. It had two, but yes. <laughs> It'll get there. You'll get there. Yeah, you're not wrong. Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Um. So. Ah, oh, you bitch. Hey. <laughs> hey. I mean, it's like four against one. <laughs> She's under level. Yeah, and that's how I liked it. <laughs> Things are going good. <laughs> now you're like, shit. <laughs> I'm gonna have to deal with these. Th yeah, he's too high up. You can't attack him. They actually, it's like actually tactics advance where if you're too high, you can't attack below. Unless you're an archer. Hey, clumsy. Hey, clumsy. Thanks for the raid. Welcome, raiders. Uh, what else? How um, was uh, Fire Emblem Engage? I think that's what you were playing. But yeah, so, uh. Who, who, who won the Rumble again? It was... Cody Rhodes. Cody Rhodes, right. And we're um, sh they're, they're actually going to... We're assuming... Okay, so he he pointed that he was going for Reigns. So... Yeah, but they're teasing that he may choose uh, Rollins. Why? So, um... <laughs> Is it because, because CM he... Punk hurt himself? Yes, sir. Oh, my fucking God. So... If Punk is hurt as bad as it sounds like he is, he's missing WrestleMania. So if he's missing WrestleMania, the original plan was um, Cody versus Roman. Had all your jewelry robbed, that's unfortunate. And Punk versus Rollins. Um, they may now be pivoting to do Punk 
or sorry, um, Cody versus Rollins, and uh, The Rock against Roman Reigns. Which means Reigns is going to win again. Correct. Hold on to it for another 365 days. On top of the, like, 1,200 he's already been champion? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, what was... What was the, the longest reigning? Sumo, Santorini, whatever. Um, Bruno Sin Santorini, whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you were close. Bruno San Martino. Yeah. What uh, was his? He's like, the longest combined reign at about 2,000 days, I think. Yeah. Um, probably Where? won't be Did passing Did you kill Irene? No. Where the fuck is she? Oh, hilarious. She should be here. Where are you, Irene? <laughs> Don't walk away, Irene. <laughs> Irene! <laughs> Irene! <laughs> Come on, Irene! <laughs> Where could you be? <laughs> There, Is I got she my, in another uh, crate? One kill. Oh, where are you, Irene? <laughs> Come on, Irene. Da, 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 da. <laughs> uh, I da, 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 I actually like that song, so... <laughs> it's a good song. Um, what's it? Um... Uh, Kevin Owens was okay, faced. So, uh, give me a second. Where is Irene? <laughs> she is legitimately gone. What the fudge? Victory for Vegeta. <laughs> Victory for Vegeta. <laughs> Look at your damn healing. Damn it. Because <laughs> you know I'll just murder him. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you do realize you've probably perfectly set up Maskerin for a Blaze 2, right? I don't particularly care. quickly <laughs> dodge fuck 19 good god he is, i don't know he is so op for some reason i guess i'm so used to hans from punch out e force one who's useless the most healing right now. Hayward. Yeah. Celestial. He's not gonna hit Grace and hope for my first ever critical hit in this game. <laughs> Irene? <laughs> Where? <laughs> I, she must have glitched or something. I might look actually have the, to I might actually have to egress because I don't look at the dungeon! I know look at the <laughs> What the hell? I can't I can't hit around the corner? <laughs> that doesn't make any sense. Oh. Am I not 
No, like, I should be able to hit that bird, man. <laughs> There's just too many people. Something we something funky's going on in this cargo warehouse area right now. Like, that should have hit more than him. That actually should have hit the bird man, too. What the fuck is going on in here? I'm gonna have to egress. I don't know what happened to Irene. <laughs> Because I am not not having Irene. <laughs> Don't walk away, Irene. <laughs> Come on, Irene. I'm going to go pile in there some more. <laughs> <laughs> There's still room. <laughs> Critical hit. First I'll ever. I'll kill you by sucking in all the oxygen. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so that's a problem. Because <laughs> Irene should have been in those crates. And you're <laughs> sure you didn't kill her, right? I'm positive. She went in the crate. I chased after her. She was gone. I don't know what to tell you. No, I I know. I just I'm I'm just <laughs> confirming. Like, <laughs> oh my god. Okay, well I gotta buy weapons just in case I fucking somehow die. <laughs> You're not the weapon shop, are you? Nope. Um. Oh, Kevin Owens. Um lost by disqualification to Logan Paul for the US title. Uh, Logan Paul brought in brass knucks. Oh, okay. Um, Kevin Owens took them away and then used them himself and got caught. Oh, he should have pulled an Eddie Guerrero and thrown him back at Logan Paul. <laughs> I know. lie on the ground. Well, no, because the title doesn't change hands on DQ. Oh. Um, and then Royal Rumble, Cody Rhodes won. Um, so yeah, I, it's going to be interesting. I, I have a feeling that they're getting the rock for WrestleMania. Probably. It's WrestleMania 40. It's a big number. So it's let's get a bunch the of rocks. It's probably the rocks last WrestleMania he'll ever wrestle. So sure. Why not <laughs> have him face reigns? Um, where's the weapon shop? Oh, here we go. Actually, this might be the white item shop. Yeah. yeah. <sighs> Still, like, eh. It won't be the last... Maybe maybe last time wrestling at WrestleMania, but definitely not the last time wrestling. Yeah, probably not. Um... And then, yeah. Uh, Rhodes versus Rollins. Um... I'm trying to think of what else they're setting up. Um, it's still kind of early in the in the road to WrestleMania, so. But yeah, even the Rumble match, it's like they didn't like the the Men's Royal Rumble had no surprises. Yeah. Um, the only surprise was um Andrade, who was a wrestler that. WWE released a few years ago, went to AEW for a bit, and is now back. Mm -hmm. I think he was number four. It was kind of a surprise to see him. That was kind of about it. Uh, on my end, Kiddo's good. Um, she's now trying to stand on everything. I told him how um, fun already, so... <laughs> like, basically, she seems to... When she learned to sit, she began to hate um, laying down. Yeah. And now that she's learned to stand, she hates sitting. Yep. And, like, she's gotten to the point now where she's got her her balance when holding things down. 
-hmm. that like she just stands like today they had her time to it was like five minutes mm -hmm. of her just standing there like staring at us and like babbling while like standing up i i'm not gonna sit down if i don't have to yeah i am a standing baby Uh, okay. Why sit when I can stand? <laughs> Pretty much. Uh, okay, so there's Irene. <laughs> She's back! So don't go into a box then. Back once again. <laughs> um, from your memory, is she computer controlled normally? Yes. Okay, that's probably why. Well, yeah, but... So she probably never goes into that area. No, she does, if I remember correctly. She tries, she runs. She actually does not fight. Interesting. Yeah. Because it's like Hayward, where I had to get to Hayward and talk to him to recruit him. Same with Irene. That's why I, I cannot finish this battle until I get to talk to her. <laughs> because, believe it or not, you get very few healers in this. I think you only get three. In the game? Yeah. Wow. So Irene's one of them. So what you're saying is, come on, Irene. <laughs> <laughs> come on, Irene. Let me stab you <laughs> right in the chest. Come on, Irene. <laughs> Three whole damage. I wonder if she keeps her experience. Oh, from the aggress? Yeah, I'm gonna check that'd that be, out. That'd be kind of funny. Eventually, she's like level 10. She's had to survive the constant gauntlet of monsters to get to Symbius. Yeah, but yeah, Riker is just being a little, little commander's being a little, it's just a little monster now. Doesn't ever want to, <laughs> doesn't ever wants to sleep. Never. Even when he's clearly tired, she does not keep her experience. Damn. That's not good for me. Great for you. <laughs> yeah, Rayla now is just she she goes down pretty easy still at night. And stays asleep all night. Mm -hmm. So I it's it's hard for me to like ever tr complain. Yeah. But nap time is now a real ordeal. Mm -hmm. Ah, like she just hates it. Wait till I, spring ahead. Like it feels like it's almost <laughs> like um, she has like FOMO, like this massive like fear of missing out no. on like the world. Yep, that that's exactly. And uh, yeah, it's uh, it's bad. Today yep. she only had one nap, mm -hmm. and like it was at like noon and so she went to bed at like six that's six straight hours of being awake for her yeah that's crazy no nope. uh, wait wait till we spring ahead and all our clocks change yay can i leave now that i'm in here uh can i get, I, I, can I get back yeah, out i think you can yeah okay uh but the barrels are gone so that means that one less obstacle for me to Breakthrough. Going back there? Don't go in the box. <laughs> I'm gonna give it one more go. I'm wondering if it's because somehow it glitched when you went in there. Okay. Because there's no way she can survive out here by herself.
There's just no way. Yeah. Why can't... Oh, flying units might... No, you got them in last time. I did. Good Why question. can't I go in here? I don't know. Ugh. Oh, maybe height also takes movement, technically speaking. I don't know. No, because then you could just take the short... Never mind. I don't know what's going on there. I mean, at least she can take some hits, but... But for how long? I mean, if I could limit a... Damn it. I don't want a map move. Aha! <laughs> oh man, really? <laughs> can you use it? Oh my god, what the fuck? Can I do it? Yes, please. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I can force you back to the church? Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> Operation Spoil Sport much? That is the biggest F you <laughs> in the world. You could be on the brink of victory and I could just be like, not today. I'm curious though, does it still come back or is it used now? I guess it stays. Oh my <laughs> god. <laughs> oh wow. Well, what the fuck is the point of that? Well, you're not supposed to be able to use it, right? Well, I'm sorry. Why give it to them? It's for me because you're supposed to drop them for me. Oh okay. god. Now, now yeah. from a now from a story plot point, I have no fucking clue. <laughs> well, I mean, okay, yeah. The dropping of I the item drop thing makes sense. Yeah. I'll I'll give you that. That that, but like there would be no reason for Oh my god. Yeah. Uh, suppose they're supposed to nap until three at the minimum, but we've been fighting tooth and nail since well before. Yeah, no, we, we kind of, we gave up at like two. We couldn't, we couldn't get him down anymore. Occasionally, when, like, he would tell us. And he would like, make it clear that he was tired and would go down. But, it, no longer a thing. At like two and a half, two, two and a half. Uh, so she, she wakes up, um, usually, like, in a typical day, we'll nap again around 9.30, then is good until her, like, 2 o'clock nap, mm -hmm. wakes up at 3, and that carries her through to bedtime. Um, but that's, like, if everything goes perfect. Mm -hmm. I cannot believe that Angel Wing worked. <laughs> and that it worked that way. I yeah. thought it was going to be like some bullshit where like that one particular computer character leaves. That's what I was kind of expecting. And instead it's just like, nope, we're all leaving now. Bye. <laughs> I get her down about 30% of the time, which really doesn't feel worth the struggle. But she gets so cranky. She doesn't... No, exactly, right? It's like, I, we know you're tired. Why don't you go down? But it's such a yep. struggle. And like... You only get it down like, yeah, occasionally. It's like, is it worth the struggle? But it's also like, they're so cranky and they're intolerable. <laughs> Sorry, but like lack of yeah. a better word. But that's literally what it feels like. Uh, 
Okay. I don't know if we'll get this battle done tonight, because <laughs> I'm not leaving without Irie. Come on, Irie. <laughs> <laughs> Like, I could survive if the goblin didn't hit four on me. I could have her just stay up there, heal while everyone comes and gets. Gets her. But that goblin hitting four is deadly. I have blocked off your means of escape. She got big feet. <laughs> she really does. They're meant for kicking. I'm wondering if there's just... They can only go through the one entrance for some reason? That seems really, really weird. Yeah. Maybe maybe they're not supposed to be able to go in the crates, but they forgot to program that one entrance for flying units. I can see that. Because, yeah, making a flying unit in such a closed space makes no sense. If I could just find a spot where she can't get surrounded and only has to worry about one, if maybe at most two units. I can't go through this one. Weird. Okay. Um. I wonder if your units are not supposed to go in there in general, and that one thing is just meant for, like, is a glitch for every unit. Maybe that's why Irene got erased. Because you're not supposed to be able to go in there. Maybe. Can can Grace? <laughs> I'd be pretty mad. <laughs> is there a way to... F I wish there was a way to find <laughs> out, but I don't... No, she can't. I'd see, I'd see the glowing squares up there. I'm just hoping this will kill. <laughs> well, one thing with this, um, uh, this like uh, cooking for everyone, including your baby thing. Yeah. I do not realize how much I have come to enjoy like sugar and salt in my foods. So, like, for example, a tomato sauce. Yep. A, can a jar of tomato sauce, right? Yeah. It's got added salt and added sugar. Yeah. And without it, it's kind of boring. Well, that's why you're supposed to use spices. But I guess you can't use spices right now. I can use some, and I do. But they're not salt and sugar. 
Yeah. Mm. Think? Stand right there. That's perfect. No, but I know it, it'd be bad, but it, I'd only be able to get surrounded by two units, right? I'm trying to I'm trying to limit how many how much I can get surrounded by, right? Right. A heal uses three MP. Yeah. So you've got two heals left. Does she have any items? And one rec medical herb. Okay. So you got three heals then. You know what? You know what? I'm actually gonna. Uh, She'll die, so I have to you know, have to heal. Yeah, yeah, you don't, you just don't like realize how much of it is in random stuff. Yeah. I goofed, I think. Yeah. Yeah, that that space where it was only two was the best, probably opportunity. Although I still don't really understand how you're supposed to get help. Well, first of all, the computer doesn't all send every single unit to get Irene. <laughs> that's the first thing. Oh, well, that's <laughs> a stupid computer. Their their main priority is to eliminate everyone. <laughs> Take that barrel. <laughs> Get five experience for attacking a barrel. Woo! Five! I have literally no idea how I'm supposed to get Irene to safety. Could you put all of your guys in here and rush through? No, I don't even think I can do that. That's what I'm trying to do right now. Don Terrace is my fast, my farthest unit. He's been charging through. My my first turn movement will determine is going to determine everything. So I had to figure out what the best move to do on her, like literally her first move. Like normally charging, but now you can just now 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 that you know you can block her exit, her one and only exit. Because I don't even think she I don't think she can jump on these crates. She can jump on the half ones, but not the full ones. Actually, I don't even think she's getting experience whenever I use her heal. I think she still acts as a uh, neutral character.
Because Grace can't, can't, Grace can't jump over that. Doesn't even look like she can jump on the freaking half ones. Oh shit. Oh, I mean, you can't use magic, so <laughs> this is not that much of a scary. Whack me with a stick? Yep. Woo! <laughs> Woo! Fire away. Dead. My god. What the fuck? That was weird. Yeah, that was weird. But it's only one of your units, it's not like he was a main one. <laughs> Whee! <laughs> <laughs> so is she gaining experience? No, she, so she's not even gaining experience right now. So yeah, she still acts as a neutral party where she doesn't gain experience. That doesn't even heal her full. That's a problem. Okay, I think I might... There's probably one way I can do this. I'll have to aggress again, but... I have to retreat her to the closest corner where only two people can attack her, and wait. Because Donteris could probably get to her now, on time. But I also have to bring, like, a, someone with a bunch of medical herbs. Yep. Okay, I gotta regress. I don't want her to die. I don't know if that'll affect what happens to her. <laughs> Fair. I don't think anyone died. Uh, no. How much money do <sighs> I have? Status. Money? Money? Cash? How do I see how much uh, It was there. Oh, was it? Oh. Yep. Oh. Right in here? Oh, yeah, 655. Cool. Okay, I can actually get a new weapon for... I could get Hayward's better weapon, even though he's already annihilating everything. I mean, no one else needs a better weapon, though. Symbios has got his best currently. Come on, talk to him. Oh my gosh, talk. Thank you. That's Symbios' best. I think that's technically Dontera's, but I don't... It's not any different. Uh, you've got the mace. This is for... Um, Irene when I actually get her. Rod, wand... I think... Yeah, those are both worse. So yeah, literally all that's left is for Hayward. Oh. What? Well, here I am talking about uh, they might be doing The Rock at WrestleMania. Yeah. Uh, the Rock was on SmackDown half an hour ago. Oh, there you go. Alright. 
so the closest corner would be there. She's just got to retreat over there and just chill. See if there's anything else here. Oh, they just, it just ended on a stare down. Okay. Stare down between Reigns and Rock. I'll be back. I'm just gonna get something to drink. Yep. I'm back. That's why they call them White Death. What are we talking about? <laughs> what? Oh. <clears throat> Got it. Okay. So yeah, that's what they're doing. It'll be uh, Rock versus uh, Rain. Oh, Salt and Shaker. That's what we call. Okay, got it. So, yeah, like, she can't jump up those crates, and you'll immediately block that with the bird. The bird is the word. So, yeah, like, having her hide here. That probably is the best move. I can't kill her with two people. No. Or at least not at any speed. We'll see. I'm hoping <clears throat> Don Terra's can just plow through this time. This would be a very long series if I can only do one battle a week. This is this is <laughs> this is pretty brutal. I'm not gonna bother with the Skaven then. To be fair, I could have won this battle the first time. It's just I'm trying to get Irene. I think that's the problem. Is like, come on, Irene, <laughs> <laughs> to get like to get some of these characters, I have to do it in the middle of the battle. That's a really, really bad system. I mean, it's a good system when it's AI, right? This is not meant like we're not playing it the way it was meant to be played. It's still a bad system. <laughs> Like, the, these should be events that happen outside of battle. Oh, they have those too. Actually, one of the secret characters is hilarious to get. <laughs> you literally just push them into the headquarters. Oh, God. 
right, here we go. They're just they're just wandering the town, and you have to physically push them into the headquarters. That's amazing. <laughs> Yeah, they can't leave. I have a feeling that that's a glitch. I don't think you're supposed to be able to leave there, and I don't think you're supposed to be able to go in there. And that's why Irene glitched and disappeared the first battle. That makes sense. There ha that has to be one of the best recruit conditions I've ever heard. Oh, pushing into the headquarters? Yeah, it's ridiculous. That's pretty awesome. The funniest thing is is the character. You're pushing pushing you're pushing wow. Wow. Um, <laughs> you are pushing a werewolf, basically Xylo from Shining Force 1, into the headquarters. An actual werewolf. Cause that's just something you do, right? Oh, well, sure. Does she get her medical hurt back? I didn't think of that. She definitely does. Oh. I'm very confident. <laughs> I hope so. <laughs> well, that's one less turn I have to get there now. Double checking. She doesn't. Oh, are you kidding me? Oh, that's some shit. That's what I have. I mean, at least the, the good news is at least I have only two trying to kill me right now. <laughs> Right, they're doing seven damage between the two of them. Yeah. The problem is that means that you can't maximize your heals. No. I really fucked myself by using that medical herb. That's seriously insane. But your your angel wings come back. Ah. <sighs> okay, so I have. Three turns. Like if she could block or dodge one turn I, or something? I will give you a fourth. Okay. Because that's some, that is some shit. Where's the entrance? Right there. Uh, I don't even have to go in. No. I just have to block you. Yeah. Okay. Let's do that.
It's not like I can even get experience for her. That's like the, the worst part of it all. So it's not like she can gradually get stronger or anything like that. Why did Donteras have to go first? Well, he's dead. The Dark Mage is definitely dead. Yep. Just, just. Yeah, as close as I thought it would be. Okay, well, you're needing to get rid of the metal and her because you don't actually have any medical herbs to give out. Symbios is out already. Grace is out now. So where do they go? Because oh, Grace pops up on the other side of the Birdman. Oh, that sucks. Oh, wait, no, they're both on the other side of the Birdman. That sucks. <laughs> My plans. <laughs> I guess that was exactly like they purposely did that so you couldn't. I must be. I'm oh, gonna send... You're on the spot they would spawn because you can't be on the map, the point where you go into the map. That's why. So it just spawns all the way around from that spot. Got it. If she only had one more HP, I could at least take one break every yep. time. Yeah. Fucking bird. I don't think I'm going to make it. <laughs> if I could have gotten Masquerin out, I would have been fine. Because then I could have just destroyed your line of People. Defenses. Yeah. Yep. <clears throat> so then, uh, one more turn. So you're gonna attack yeah. this turn, but the next turn is. It, I skip. Yeah. Uh, I can't get in there. Damn. Okay. Well, I gotta keep you blocked, so. Let's go here. I really feel like you moved them already. Before I got to move Grace and Symbius this turn. The turn orders are whack. <laughs> Your stir. That'll come in handy next round.
if Maskrin had went first before Don Terrace, Don Terrace would have gotten out. Now, whether or not made a, whether or not that would have made a difference, actually, yeah, I would have gotten three people out instead of just the two. Dodged. There's your dodge. Yeah. Oh fuck. <laughs> we might not get this battle done at all. We might get no battles done this turn. This <laughs> week. Oh my god. So, yeah, you're skipping this turn. Yep. How much damage do you do to a bird man? You do four. Yeah, if Maskerin was out, this would not be a problem right now. Correct. This is the most broken game. It's not broken. Don't forget, your to control enemies is not a main function of the game. This is still pretty messed up. Well, there you go. She joined the shining force. I don't know I if that. Kill her now. I don't know if that perm like. Oh yeah, she'd actually teleported away with. Now the way that actually checks to see if she's in my uh, party now. No, she's not. Okay, can we please go back to the battle and see if she's gone? I'm not saving. <laughs> I am not saving. <laughs> I mean, listen, with all the other shit going on, like, <laughs> she's just fucking gone. <laughs> oh my god. She's like, you're now, she's like in the enemy now? Oh, you're helping me. <laughs> That's perfect. Um, they took too damn long. I'm joining you guys. Sorry, I'm gonna transfer some of these over to Don Terrace. Oh my God. Okay, she's there. Okay, be right back. Yep. I'll wait for Mitch to get back before I continue. Oh, I don't, I have no idea what to do here. Because I already tried the one thing. Actually, there's got to be. Because I, he will immediately block Irene here. She'll get surrounded. And down here, she's super far away. Like, if she could just jump over, like, one set of crates, it would be fine, because then I would just jump around or whatever and get in. There's, like, literally nothing I could do.
That's a interesting one. Huh. Okay, I'm back. Look at this. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I'm supposed to be able to do that. This is a perfectly cromulent game. Yeah. All right. Let's move you in there. I've got to figure out... I gotta maximize the. See, I... this is the quickest way for her. So, yep, run into the corner again. You know what? Dontera's leveling up might have fucked me. Because that's why he's going before Maskrin now. Um. One question. Yeah. So you keep going to a place where only two enemies can hit. Which I get. But. If you're somewhere that three enemies can hit. You can still survive while maximizing your heals. No, I'd still be healing. You would. It wouldn't change that fact, but you could probably get somewhere closer to that entrance. Or help will arrive faster. Just a thought. It is. But I don't think you still you still have me all pinned in that corner, so it, it wouldn't have not it would not have changed, really. Yeah, fair. Not to mention with three uh, three enemies attacking, that's like an additional chance of a possible rare chance of a critical hit. That's true. Okay, it hasn't happened yet, but... <laughs> that possibility is there. <laughs> I guess he'll go through this one then. No, you can't hit them. Basically, how do I be the biggest pain in the ass for you? I think Don Terra's will get will get through it regardless, so. Like if if she could just jump up this one set of crates. All would be well. I really feel like you're not supposed to be going in there. <laughs> Cuz you Probably can't go not. in you can't go into any other any of the other holes, so Yeah. <laughs> 
have to die. If you don't heal, you will die. Yeah, but you can only move five squares. Can you get to me in five squares? One, two, th three. One, two. Three. It's close. No, you can only get to this one. Okay. I'm just I'm 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 not gonna be able to get to her this turn either. I'm I'm trying to plan things. Okay. Well, she's not getting experience, so she's definitely not on my force. Have a good night, Clumsy. Thanks for dropping by, and thanks for the raid. Hey, have a good night. Okay, yeah, so you can still reach. It said five movement, but that's six, is it not? <laughs> I think so. That seems like a problem. Add it to the list. <laughs> so again, in theory, if I use Blaze 2... Okay, now it works. Remember... Huh. Remember it didn't let me do that before? Wait, now it's just... See, it's not letting me use the... It's doing that weird thing where it's not actually... Technically, this should be hitting the three of them, but it's only going to hit the two of them. They don't... Correct. It doesn't think those two birdsmen are on the map because they're not supposed to be there. <clears throat> oh my god, that's awesome. This is so hard. <laughs> I'm just breaking every element of this game. Now, Down Terrace is gonna go, but he's not gonna be able to. Fuck. Oh, fuck off. <laughs> Why? It. it... It should have been Symbiosis. Are you fucking kidding me? They shouldn't be in the fucking map to begin with.
Sorry, I was so quiet. I'm really trying to figure out how the fuck I'm gonna do this. <laughs> you could always walk away from Irene. No. Fuck that. <laughs> You're already glitching the game, so... <laughs> <laughs> like, I can't... I legit can't even use magic on your bird. Beautiful. I love it. Hit me with your stick. Oh, I can't... No, I can't even attack! I tried! Well, then how come everyone else can attack me? I tried to attack her, but it, it went straight to defense. Look it! See, hold. So now go to attack. Oh. Yeah, no, you can't. You can't come in here with your birds. Well, <laughs> not with that particular bird. How come the other one was fine? I don't know. Okay, I'll get him out of there. Um. Oh God. This is going to be weeks. Can I see one second? That bird has 18 HP. This one has 18 HP. The one in the... the... I know why. Is it a different kind of birdman? That's the birdman that retreats. Oh, crap. It has a trigger on it. Yeah. Okay. Interesting. So the one with 16 HP can't go in there. Okay. This might be weeks of me just level up grinding at this rate, because... Let me see. Yeah, I can't even leave now, because... No, he's a... You, we, we won't be able to tell which one it is, then. I thought, he, I thought that one had 16 HP for some reason. He can't leave. We're just totally stuck. I just hold wow. him. Wow. I just hit egress and it didn't let me egress? No, you tap down to defend. Or, or end. No, I'm pretty I saw, sure. I saw you move. I. <sighs> Alright, well, don't kill Irene. Yeah, that's fine. Just, just put it, leave everyone there. Save us the time of you moving and just, because. I'm just going to egress. <laughs> I swear I hit egress. I thought I was in the magic and I hit egress. I'm just gonna move you over, whatever, here for a second. Okay, I'm gonna actually see. No, I can't use egress here. Are you kidding me? I actually have to. I, I thought as much. Okay, so. Don't kill her again. I'm literally trying to just do egress right now. 
Can I try to kill you? No, because <laughs> you, you already glitched the game enough. I feel like now it's getting a little unfair. Oh, oh. fine. Everyone else is like one damage anyway. And you're not even gonna give him like I. You're not even giving me a lot of experience when I do kill your enemies. That's the funny thing. You're giving me like ten experience. Sorry, now I'm just holding them all there. While I guess to Symbius again. Oh my goodness. I am getting two turns to your one. It makes no cases. sense. Like, these guys are all going again before Symbius is gone already. These turns make no sense when you move in and out of the maps. I think going in and out of the maps is fucking the turn order. You've already attacked him with all those units. Correct. But I can't get to Irene any quicker. I can't do it the other way. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Your game is cooked, mate. <laughs> Holy shit. Are we trying again? Yep. <laughs> I want right. to try one other thing. <laughs> so you still go here. You have to go this way. This is the final go. <laughs> <laughs> and in my final go, I mean, uh, I'm I'm still not giving up on Irene. Like, mm -mm. <clears throat> I wish you'd just walk away. <laughs> you obviously don't find this funny. You're getting very frustrated. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, so no Birdman can go inside, but I'll send other things in there because... Well, that's... yeah, because you don't know which Birdman it was that you... that glitched it. Exactly. You know what? I think it was that one there. I just to be safe. I just won't. Okay, that's stupid. 
they were able to talk? Yeah. That's funny. Now, hopefully what this means, like, it means she still technically didn't join the party officially, because I had to win the battle. But maybe she gets experience. <laughs> So no, she that does not reach. I was curious. <laughs> now to solve your problem. That yeah, would have. I should have tried using an item. <laughs> I, I'm assuming it wouldn't work either, but <laughs> with this game, you don't know. <laughs> What do you mean using an item? I should try using a medical herb and seeing if it reached over the grates. Oh! Shit, who knows? You're right. <laughs> <clears throat> the game's programming is hanging on by a thread. Okay, let's see. Does she get experience now when punching? Yes. She got one experience. <laughs> well, fan fucking tastic. There's only one other thing I'm trying to see if... There's one other thing. Can he? Yes, he can. Crap. That's a problem. That was the one last thing. I said if 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 he could not attack, I would I like we would be here for weeks. But now that he can attack, I can protect her to a degree. I was, gonna, I was gonna be like, can she cast magic? I'm like, no, no, because Grace couldn't cast magic that high, so why would she be able to cast her fire that high? That made no sense. I really wish she had heal too. Yep. Because then I could just heal to Don Terez and get him to charge out now. Because I made you move out of the spot. So now she gets experience when she heals, so she'll get like 10. 11. 15. Okay, she gets 15. 10, 11, 15. <laughs> I'm learning to count. 1, 2, 5, 7.
See, this is where it's fine, because guess how much damage he does to her? Only two, two instead of three. Correct. So, I'm trying to figure out the best way of... <laughs> yeah, I think, I think I know a way to do it now. It won't work this time around, but it'll work the next time around. Because the problem is actually him. Correct. But what I would do the next time round is not leave Hayward by himself down there. Yeah, he needs help. Yeah. I'd have Obrit stay behind, or even Maskrin. Smart. What, attacking the mage? Yeah. Yeah. Actually, I, I was hoping it'd kill, because I don't know exactly. Okay, she's you she's did. got it. Healing drop heals more, so get rid of nothing. I'm out! <sighs> These two, um... <laughs> I feel like I got out way sooner this time round, so I don't think you're going to have me surrounded. No. No, I couldn't get my troops there fast enough. It doesn't matter, you go twice anyways. <laughs> Okay, so he does four, he only does two. So Correct. I can last a round of attacking. Yep. So you, you can last two rounds instead of one. Yep. Because the math works out in your favor. <clears throat> the problem is Hayward can get surrounded. But honestly, the difference is, is Hayward can die. He's fine. He's already part of my team. Irene's not. <laughs> so if I can get rid of that goblin, and then she can just beeline it to Symbius. Again, I don't think I can do it this time around, because I really should have left someone behind for with Hayward. But... Unless I can somehow get Grace up there. But she's barely surviving on her own, so... Okay, get rid of that. doesn't matter, you're gonna go have to go again and block me anyways. <laughs> or maybe not, there might be so many units up there that it, I, you won't be able to block me anymore. Yep. <laughs> that is a lot of damage though. That's, yeah. That's your most amount. You gotta get Symbius in that one. There you go. God, Terrace is dead.
fine. He can be revived. See, this is the problem. Then, yeah. It should have been Symbiosis and Grace's turn by now. Too little, too late. Fuck, you couldn't be one turn sooner, could you? I don't care if it's a waste, I just want you fucking dead. <laughs> Blaze level three. Or Lernix Phoenix. We got their summons in this one. Too high. Which one's your leader? <laughs> Wish I knew which one your leader was. Or is it actually all of them? I don't remember. How come your bird guy didn't retreat this time? Hmm. You still there? 
Mitch? Hello? Have you disappeared? Mitch has gone silent. I'm actually gonna have to be aggressive because I cannot risk. I can't hear you at all, Mitch. You're you're not there anymore. I don't know how long you've been gone for. All that money's gone. Well, we're gonna end it there, anyways. So we literally did not succeed in doing the fucking one battle this week. Ah. <sighs> uh, yeah, Mitch is kind of gone for now. Good. <laughs> um, but yeah, we'll be back. I uh, fucking I maybe next week. Honestly, oh. What about now? Now I can hear you. Okay. What happened? No, it's just been a must have been an audio glitch. Maybe I pulled on my uh, my headphone awkwardly. Oh, okay. Yeah. I don't know when you disappeared. It was quiet for a long time. <laughs> oh crap. So um, why why did you you didn't even want to try to win? Well, no, because if you knocked out Irene, I didn't know what would happen. Oh, okay. That's fair. Um. Again, I think. Honestly, I don't know what the right thing to do is. Because even if I left Obright behind... Like, I guess I would just keep... I would just have to keep Irene there, but she only has so many more heals, right? And since I can't put Birdman in the underground part, I just sending them right to her. Yeah. Wait, I wonder well, if it, I wonder if it changed that I actually talked to her. She actually is. No, never mind. It was wishful thinking. <sighs> that was hilarious. Birdman talks to her. She joins the Shining Force. You aggress. She leaves with you. Disappears. Mm -hmm. Even this case, when I actually as Hayward got her to join that's so weird man like I get it but still I don't get it <laughs> I get it from a story pers standpoint like um, you know you're in the middle of a battle and she joins you but you when you egress like she shouldn't really be going with you but at the same time like what the fuck am I supposed to do I want to quickly check something. Can I? Ah, yes. Okay. Give. I'm going to deposit some things with you. Like that. I'll keep that one. That's the Dwarf Hill one. We can put that in there. I don't know why we keep carrying these around. Oh, and Mithril. There we go. Yeah, I have, I have I have no idea. I have no idea the option. Like, if I could give her, like, medical ear... If I can't use them, but if I could give her medical herbs from the bottom, that would be fine as well, but I don't even think I could do that. Well. Uh... All right, that's it for this week. Fuck. Not, not one battle. That has never happened. Well, that's a lie. It happened at the chess battle. But you eventually just gave it to me because that was never going to happen. Um, in Shiny Force 2. But yeah. Other than that, this has never happened. This is only battle fucking what? Five? Six? Yeah. And this <laughs> is week four? Yeah. 
Yeah. And there's eight chapters. This is cha the first battle of chapter two. Wait, is there? There might only be four chapters. No, that doesn't make any sense. I'll have to look that up. Regardless. Yeah, we'll be back next week, maybe. No, actually, we won't because I will actually not be around next week. I will be visiting my parents next week, so there will be nothing okay. Friday. Cool. All right. Sounds good. I'll have a break from this madness. I'll have to write down a strat. I'm going to have to fucking legitimately strategize. I mean, I that's what I've been doing. <laughs> I've been eliminating possible things. But every time I come up with a new strategy, you see other things as well. And <laughs> oh. Oh. I guess the other problem is, is the, the fact that you get, like, two turn Like, when I go in and out of that minimap, the turns get screwed up so bad that you go twice before my units go. Right, yeah. that That's a real problem. But that's the quickest way I can get to Irene. So, I have no idea how else to go about it, so... Strategy. I'll have to figure that out. Uh, but yeah, I'll be back tomorrow, maybe with Clumsy. And, uh... Yeah, no, then there'll be nothing next week. Unless I stream by myself during the week sometime. Uh, but probably not. So you all have a good night. Stay safe, stay awesome, and don't forget to check the loss. Have a good weekend.